So this past year, we've experienced more complaints about neck and shoulder pain. This, so a lot of people have been asking, are there any stretches or exercises that I can do for my neck to help alleviate this discomfort? But let's be honest, you're not going to do those exercises. Nobody ever does. So today we're going to show you a way to help alleviate that discomfort without doing any exercises or stretches. Spending an extra 30 seconds or a minute doing exercises or stretches is not going to compete with the daily habit of spending 8 to 10 hours a day or longer in front of your computer screen. So what we've got to do is we've got to change that daily habit in order to make big changes with that neck and shoulder discomfort. First, let's take a closer look as to why we might be experiencing a little bit more neck and shoulder pain. So body positioning is one reason. As you can see, when I'm hunched over, the way that my head carriage is right now, that's a lot of extra weight that my body has to carry. We all know that that slouch position is no good for those muscles. One of the other things that's happening is as you slouch down into this nice C position, we're compressing our diaphragm. So we're not giving it space to move the same way that we would in an upright position. So our rib cage has a lot more trouble expanding and taking in that air. So, so some of the accessory muscles that we use for breathing are in our neck and they attach into the shoulder area. So putting extra strain on these muscles just to help us breathe starts to create more tension and strain within the neck and shoulder area. Our tissues start to adapt to repeated exposure of loads. So if we find ourselves in these positions that are slouched over for extended periods of time, the tissue wants to reinforce that shape so that you can carry yourself a little bit more efficiently. That does fascia, which is the most abundant connective tissue in the body, is like a web that spiders its way through everything to help support things. Fascia has been shown to readapt about every 20 minutes or so. So if you're sitting in a position for longer than that, your fascia is going to slowly creep and tighten into that position so that you can stay there for an extended period of time. That's going to create a lot of aches and pains throughout the neck and shoulder area. So the easiest solution, and I've given this to a lot of people and they told me how game changing it is for them, is to set a timer or alarm for every 15 to 20 minutes that reminds you to just get up and move. So you don't necessarily have to do exercise, you just have to change positions. I'm not talking about going from a seat position to another sledge position. You actually have to get up and stand a little bit, shake out, walk around. That's gonna change things for you. Take a minute or two to do that, and then you can sit back in, reset, and get back to work. If you guys like this video, found this information helpful, please share it. Thanks a lot for watching.